Hello, this is Embedded Engineer, and today I will show you how you can use the ESP32 7 inch dev board from Waveshare with Skyline Studio and Espressive IDE. I have already shown the unpacking of the display in a short. If you are interested, you can just look in the shorts feed. For the start, you need the board drivers that I uploaded to my GitHub. First, we need to put the border drivers in the correct folder. On Windows, this is located under Users, then the User folder, then look for the Square Line folder. Then click on the Boards folder and then on Espressive. Here you put the driver folder from GitHub. Once that's done, you can now open Square Line and see the WaveShare board under Espressive. Here you can then change the theme or the project name. Once everything is set up the way you want it, you can now create the project. I'm now creating a simple example interface to show how exporting and uploading works. Now that we have exported the project, we can try to upload it. To do this, we open the Expressive IDE and create a new ESP32 S3 project. Then we import the exported Squareline project by right-clicking Import. Once that's done, you can build the project once to make sure everything fits. If this error occurs, that has something to do with LVLG config, you can easily repair it. Go to SDK config and wait for this file to load. Then scroll down to the LVGL config and open it. Then scroll down to the point about what the error message was about and take out the rake. Don't forget to save. Now we start the building process again and this time it should be run through. These error messages appears when the function is not used but is declared. Perfect. Now we can connect the board and upload the code. It is important that you connect the board to the UART port and not the USB port, which is only used for power supply. And there we have our desired result. Thank you for watching, feel free to write a comment if you want me to explain anything else or if it doesn't work for you and see you next time.